Agnes, what difference, if you're working at Tyra, what difference do you think it's making at the home? Um, our focus, uh, the, the girls, yeah, and uh, the same girls, um, and the girls are already in a puberty, right? Uh, who actually experience so many different changes, and one of them being menstruation. Yeah, uh, working with these girls has uh, has given me an opportunity to see really uh, the impact of the work that we do in their lives. How? Um, you know, growing up, I did not, for example, think that uh, menstruation was such an issue. Yeah. Because I had my parents providing for me everything. Yeah. But coming to these communities and looking at these girls in these rural places who do not have the basic requirements to make sure that they go through that period in the most comfortable and positive yeah. way. So, you know, the things that we do in these communities, we teach them, we give them uh, sanitary towels. Yeah. And this is, has helped so much to make sure that these girls stay in school, yeah. making sure that they live a normal social life, they are yeah. able to interact normally even during their periods, yeah. and they have expressed this yeah. from the stories that they have shared with us. Right. So, uh, being able to, to cause that change in the life of a girl who would have probably chosen to drop out of school, yeah. Or stay out of school at the time when she's achieving her period. So it enables them to stay in school, is it? Yes. Yeah. Uh, what what did you, what, did, what does that mean for them? They could stay in school. If they can stay in school, it means that they can live their full potential. Nice. Kind of yeah. They can go to school like any other child yes. in the urban setting. Yeah. They can you know pursue their dreams. Yeah. They can uh, engage in any social activity. Yeah. yeah. Because. We've got to learn from our work that during their period, these girls stay away from yeah. school, which really uh, is not a proper way for yeah. any child to be growing up. So um, this is an opportunity to change all that kind of uh, behavior in the community. And sometimes it's not it's not really by choice. No. Some of their parents cannot afford, yeah. much as they would want to. For those who are aware, they can't even afford yeah. to provide for their girls oh, or they want yeah. to go to We take it so much for granted, don't we? Yeah, we take it for granted. We think it's a normal thing, yeah. like everybody should be able to manage this. Yeah. But when you hear a story, for example, like a girl having to use dried banana fibers yeah. during her period, yeah. then you will know that you cannot take it for granted. Mm -hmm. It's something that is very important to be uh, addressed in order to give every child an opportunity to live a normal life. And Agnes, what about you? What is it that keeps you here? Yeah. I mean, so when I joined IRAIDS, uh, Miss Fisher Boys, yeah, we are going to teach people that they are kind of about it. Yeah. It was really not a big deal. Yes, I, I can say they also, um, during my primary, I, I got the information. I was at a good school. I had products yeah. that I had provided from before I started yeah. my period. But uh, when you interact with young girls, I mean, there's so many different stories. Yeah, yeah. girls will come and tell you, um, I didn't know this. I was so uncomfortable. Uh, blood came out and I didn't know what to do. I thought I had a disease. Yeah. I thought I was ill. Yeah. There's so many misconceptions and we provide the education and the information and girls so I open it, yeah. and so someone has a, a good experience when they're having their period, yeah. and they're confident about oh. them being in their period. And then when you interact further with, with girls, they can actually stand up when they are with boys, and they can say, I'm in my period, and this is what I'm able to do, this is what I've been able to, to achieve. Uh, some of them will say, usually, when I'm having my period, Sit at the back of the classroom. I won't do anything. Yeah. I'll keep to myself. Yeah. I'll, I'll kind of hide away. Yeah. But after the education, they're so confident. Right. They 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 participate in yeah. things. So it's very rewarding work yeah. when you, especially when you interact with the yeah. girls.